I wanted um, to know, you said earlier about the white and black water fountain mm -hmm. in the, I guess, the main areas right near Lee College. Were you allowed to drink from the white fountain? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. I was uh, allowed to drink from the white fountain. And um, even though you're allowed to eat, drink from the white fountain and in the theater, were you allowed to sit al alongside whites or did y'all have to sit behind whites in the theater? I don't remember having to sit behind whites. I think we probably had um, we always kind of sat in the middle. You know, you have a favorite place that you like to sit. Uh, but I don't remember anybody ever telling me I needed to sit further back or in another area. No. Um, but I do remember uh, it happening with the blacks. And even though you were able to drink from the water fountains and sit next to whites, did you feel that you had the same privileges of whites in the city? You know, when I was a kid, I just, I didn't think that there was segregation, first of all. I didn't understand that concept. So for me, it was a normal process. I just had a good time. I was a happy kid. Uh, my parents exposed us to many things. And uh, uh, I feel that I enjoyed my youth. I never felt um, that I was set aside or looked at differently uh, because I was a kid. I didn't really experience um, racism until I became an adult.